of the biggest reasons that I joined Cummins was because of the culture. Yes, we're a diesel company, we're a manufacturing company, but we're actually very forward thinking. I really am passionate about Cummins being known for what it does for empowering women and actually helping to rise women up in our community. Women who are empowered in the sense that they have access to education, they have access to health care, they have access to the ability to work. They create a community that is stronger than for women who don't have that. The Cummins Powers Women program provides an answer to the cry for help from millions of women and girls around the world who are in dire need for someone to stand up and address the plight that they face. How do you make the communities that you live in, you work in, better? And therefore, how do you make society a little bit better? How can we really look at women's empowerment and say, how can we make a difference? There's a responsibility to do this, and it makes us a better company. The reason Cummins exists in the first place is to make people's lives better by powering a more prosperous community. I strongly believe that the Cummins Powers Women Initiative allows us to hold a mirror to ourselves and what we're doing internally at Cummins and reflect that on our communities. The important question for each leadership team that leads at this company is, what do you want your legacy to be? And so our leadership team did a lot of thinking about that. I'd like to make an impact on making the world a more just place for women and girls. It, it clearly is not today. It's making an engine's hard, making the world more just for women and girls is bigger. Women and Girls Initiative, it's different. We are launching it as a top level initiative for the company at large. We worked really hard to find nonprofit partners around the world who had research based programs, metrics in place, and a really strong track record of engagement with women and girls. From on the ground mentoring and teaching of women and girls, all the way up to leadership development and advocacy at a regional level. And all of these programs we're putting together in a global program that Cummins is supporting. We want to do this across the company and we want our leadership team to be directly engaged in this big initiative so we can have a bigger, more sustainable and long-lasting impact. Wanting to be part of this program isn't just a personal piece. This isn't all about Sherry's a female and therefore it makes sense for her to be involved in this. I think there's also a lot for women and men to come together and actually talk about these issues. I'm now a father of a nine-year-old girl. I want my daughter to have every opportunity as she goes into the future. I look forward to a world where she can be anything that she wants to be. I was raised in a family of mostly girls where gender was never an issue, where my parents looked at me as an empowered person and, and told me that I could have whatever I wanted to if I worked hard for it. And I want every girl in the world to have the same opportunity that I had, to not look at gender at all in terms of a barrier, but to only see the opportunities that exist in the world. We've never done something as big and global as this on one topic. So what I'd like to ask you as leaders to do is lead on this initiative for women and girls empowerment in the same way that you would lead any other business initiative of Cummins. Let me count on you to make a difference in this area. I, I know that we can make the world a better place as a result. Yeah.